All right, guys. So basically, we got this tube off of the grommet, the drain plug. And see, so you see how I got my pliers in there? Like these are 11-inch pliers I got from Harbor Freight. So we're going to try to wiggle this. And we're going to try to get this grommet, this drain tube thingy typey free. Because, you know, there are multiple options for this, guys. We can either do this and get this cleaned up and use this stock tube, or we can go ahead and take another tube and we can drain it down to where I drilled a couple of holes in the floorboard, or we can do a T-connection to go to the AC condensate line. But let me see. Did it come out? I think it did. Yes, it did come out. Well, interesting. Now let's see if we can actually get this thing out. Maybe if I release it from the pliers get my finger in there oh and it fell hold on I almost got it guys ah okay folks there it is so do you see right there now this this what happened here was a little bit of the seal is kind of messed up this is a 2012 see there see the gunk guys see all that gunk inside right here and the gunk inside this baffle what we're gonna do we're gonna take this baffle out of here and then that's just gonna let everything flow through some people take a straw but we're not gonna do that we're just gonna get this baffle and then that kind of goes in conjunction with this I did see some gunk so the way that the way it works is this tube see guys it clips on like that and then it was into the car right there so what's happening all the gunk is backing up and because of all this crap and then it was just backing up and leaking out and the, the hose wasn't even really on it was only on like this because the water was forcing it off so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna clean this off and what we're gonna use to clean that initially is that red piece wherever that red piece is oh it's up on top so you guys you can take one of these things right here and we're just going to use it to clean this but we're actually going to go wind up going into the house we're going to go in the house we're going to run some water on this and then we're going to go ahead and take a pair of pliers and pop this baffle off and i'll come back and i'll show you guys what it looks like with the baffle off and then we'll put it back in